Here is our flip book for our spiral. I was going to try and write this as I was going through it, but it was going to take a really long time. So the first flap, the outside of the flap looks like what says table of contents. And underneath the flap, you can see where I have written right here, it says table of contents. And that is just basically a list of what we do on each page. I apologize in advance for my messy handwriting. The second flap on the outside, it has an arrow pointing to the right hand side of the page and that's here, RHP, right hand page. These are notes, what I get from the teacher, meaning you. So this is what I give you and that will go on the right hand side. And then the next flap is the left hand side. The left hand side of the page is where you will do your homework, your observations, questions. Sometimes I will give you a handout that goes on that page because you are going to be doing the work in there. The next page says the, the next flap is the rule of the page. The rule is we have to number the pages. And the reason is, is that we want everybody to be on the same page. So everybody's on the same page, which means that we're, we're in a sense, we're making our own textbook and my page 30 should look like your page 30. The rule of the attachment means no loose stuff. If I give you something, we have to tape it down, glue it down, duct tape it down. We want to make sure that everything is in the spiral, whether it's taped the, you know, vertically, horizontally, folded, flip book, we have no loose stuff. And that just means that everything is taped or glued down. Periodically, I'm going to collect your spiral. And this is where um, I'm going to give you stamps or stickers. I'm going to check your tables of contents to make sure that the information is written down. And this is just going to keep you honest, make sure that you're keeping up to date. This is probably the hardest thing to do because it requires you to write stuff down. And sometimes we don't have a lot of time. When we go over this in class, I will explain and give you some examples of what we will be writing down for our table of contents. So this is all you need to do tonight is just make sure that this little flip book is filled out. Hopefully it's a little bit neater than um, what I did and I will see you tomorrow.